Oh, they do, went and did it. They uh, passed the Reduction Act. Now you're looking at another 50 cents to 75 cents added on in taxes on gas alone, on fuel alone. Um, told you you weren't going to get out of this reduction in price due to the quote unquote fuel tax holiday that you were able to have without paying for it. Now you're going to get to pay for it. Told you so. But let's look at some other things. They're uh, adding on billions of dollars to uh, their pet projects. Uh, they're going to tax the people that bring our goods, the truckers. They're taxing the trucking companies. They're taxing all these other big corporations that bring in our uh, goods so we can uh, have goods on the shelves. Guess what? Then people are not going to lose their GDP. They're going to keep their GDP. And you're going to lose out of your pocket. You will not be able to afford what you once could, just like you can't afford it hardly now. Guess what? It's going to be as bad as 1920s. Good luck, people. That's all I can say. Good luck. Because you keep saying it don't happen. It don't happen. It won't happen. It don't happen. You can trust the government, but yet, why am I turning around and telling you I told you so, I told you so, I told you so? I'm telling them, what, six of these now of I told you so's? <laughs> Maybe y'all might want to wake up and actually read something and try to do something about it. But you don't want to. You'd rather keep your head in the sand like a freaking ostrich. Oh, I'll put my head in the sand. I don't see nothing going on, so there's nothing going on. Tell you, your children, your grandchildren, your nieces, your nephews, your uncles, your aunts. Having to come to you, or you're going to have to go to them and beg them to have food. You're going to have to beg them to get feminine products. You're going to have to beg them for whatever. And yet, you don't see anything wrong. <laughs> All I can say is good luck. And I told you so.